Hello everyone, my name is Jason. Here is the research on SSI. First, let me introduce our group member to you. Apart from me, the members of our group are Yuki, Yuli, and Andy. In the beginning, I will introduce the item and overview to you. Then Andy and Yuki are going to give a brief introduction of two schools. After that, Yuli will provide the questionnaire data and analysis. Finally, I will conclude. This presentation is delivered by students of the Surrey International Institute, which is located at the Dongbei University of Finance and Economics, Dalian, China. And this is our institute's logo, a combination of two university logos. The students are in their preparatory year before studying accounting and finance and international business management. This information is taken from ISII's official website. Students study English for academic purposes and other academic courses to prepare for the degrees, to better understand the students' motivations and reactions to the year. A questionnaire was designed and delivered to the student body, which is related to English learning, then to get a deeper insight into reasons, including why students choose the International Cooperation Institute, to be more specific, why they choose ISII. How was their experience and what are their aspirations for the future? The questionnaire was completed anonymously, involving students from different majors to collect accurate feedback information and make the survey results more representative and credible. This presentation will share the most important findings. Next, Andy from our team will give you an overview of Duffy. Okay, thank you, Jason. Now I'm going to give you a brief introduction of Dufi and the University of Surrey. Dufi, fully named Dongbei University of Finance and Economics, located in Dalian, Liaoning Province, is a university with more than 17,000 full-time students and ranking among the top five in the province. As early as the 1980s, Dufi has carried out substantive international exchanges and formally launched Sino Foreign Cooperative Education in 1994. Up to now, Dufi has established various forms of friendly and cooperative relations with 129 institutions of higher education in 27 countries of eight international organizations and has carried out long-term and stable exchanges as well as corporations with over 50 universities. Dufi has the first research base for Chinese foreign corporate educational institutions in China and has cooperated with China Service Center for Overseas Studies to build a training base for it. Dufi is the leading school of Sino-British Cooperative Educational Alliance and the partner of CFA University Program. The major Financial accounting has been fully certificated by CPA Australia. The university now has one Sino Foreign Cooperative Educational Institute, Surrey International Institute. We also call it SII, which provides full-time undergraduate and postgraduate education. Its double degree courses in international business and tourism management are accredited by AACSB, and the double degree courses in financial accounting are accredited by ACCA. In addition, there are also six Sino Foreign Cooperative Educational Projects with the University of Western Ontario in Canada, Cruton University in Australia, and Oster University in the UK. Besides, Dufi has led the establishment of Sino-British Cooperative Educational Alliance. Then, here comes Surrey. The University of Surrey is a well-known public comprehensive research university located in Guildford, England. Now, has 9,300 scholars. It, is, it was founded in 1891 at Battersea Institute of Technology in London. The University of Surrey became a comprehensive university under Royal Charter on 9 September 1966. It is home to one of the world's leading schools of hotel and tourism management, ranked fifth in the world and first in the UK. This is why Surrey has partnered with Dufi to offer three majors in tourism management, international business management, and financial accounting at SII. As the highest academic honor in the UK, the University of Surrey has been awarded 
the Queen's anniversary medal for four times. It ranked around 200 in the World's University Rankings and 272 in 2022 QS World University Ranking. As I mentioned above, SII is the joint institute between Duffy and Sari. Now let's welcome Yuki to introduce SII to us in details. Thank you, Andy. SII is a joint educational initiative that is established by Duffy and Sari. It was approved by China's Ministry of Education in 2007. Up till now, there are approximately 90 faculty members at home and abroad, as well as 1,300 students in SII. Our institute offers three undergraduate majors, including international business management, financial and accounting, and tourism management. There are the competitive advantage programs of Duffy and Sari. To be precise, all of them are listed in the first batch of China's national first three undergraduate programs and ranked in the top ten in the UK. Unlike most of the international cooperation institutes in China, SII implements a four plus zero academic system. Which means the students are allowed to stay in China for the whole courses. The benefit is that SII truly fulfills the wish for receiving international education without going abroad. Thus, SII may suffer less impact abroad by the coronavirus. Apart from that, students can also select three plus one and two plus two to study in England. Duffy and Sari provide scholarship for excellent students, and students who meet the graduation requirements. To receive a diploma and degree certificate from both universities, with the motto of inclusiveness, resourcefulness, and action, and the mission of paying equal attention to humanistic spirit and professional quality, cultivating management talents with global vision and international competitiveness, providing intellectual support for enterprise management practice, our institute have built talent cultivation mod according to the international standards of business school. Moreover. Based on the cultivation idea of student-centered, SII established a holistic academic support system containing CAES, SSC, Overseas Study, Career Development Center, and Alumni Center. As for the overseas exchange opportunities, SII has built relationship with Surrey, LSE, Columbia University, etc. Students are able to apply for summer school and winter school. Or in order to improve linguistic ability, deepen the understanding and application of professional knowledge, and get insight into the international job market requirements. After 30 years of exploration and practice, the college has made great progress and significant achievements in personnel training, faculty construction, academic research, and other aspects. Okay, next let's welcome Yuli to share questionnaire and data analysis. Hello, everyone. I'm Yuli. I will introduce our questionnaire and some data analyze. We collected 200 questionnaire from different majors and grades. The question in the questionnaire mainly focus on student with a joint educational initiative and SI. Our purpose is to find out the reason for choosing SI, student experience at SI, and plan in the future. Reason for choosing SI. And can be seen from the following chart. Most students choose the SI as a platform and transition because they want to study abroad for postgraduate. The lower scores are also a highlight of SI, with the most students choose the SI because of the lower inter barriers and the so-called low scores to top schools. The huge difference in the third chart also shows that the reputation of Duffy is the main reason. Why most students choose SI, and this is exactly the attractiveness of a joint educational initiative. The two schools complement each other and become stronger together. Experience and SI. We did a cross analysis of the relationship between the major and English subject that improved most in a year. We found that there are great differences in the improvement of English for students. Of different majors, most of the students of accounting and finance and business management think that speaking is the biggest one to improve, while the students of tourism management think that listening is the biggest one to improve, followed by speaking. But looking at the overall situation, speaking is the biggest attraction of SI. 
it can also be seen from the chapter two that most students like the kissing method of SI and think that SI is successful. Plan for future. That can be seen from the following chart. Studying abroad is the main intention of SI students. The advantages of job educational initiative and the innovation of SI abroad module provides them with the confidence of going abroad. As you can see from the chapter in chapter two, there are also many students who want to stay in China, which is a true reflection of our study abroad, not abroad model. That's all for my part. Next, let's invite Jason to make a conclusion. Thanks, Yuli. Thank you for your insightful and detailed analysis. Data analysis through a series of school information and questionnaire, we gain a deeper understanding of Dizzy and Surrey. We know how they united and joined forces to run an institute. In addition, we have seen how efficiently the two schools have worked together and how well the result has been achieved. We also hope that they will continue to preserve in their collaboration for the future of both schools and for the sake of nurturing better talent. Overall, the responses received to the questions in the questionnaire all point to the one call. SII has encouraged students to be interested in studying abroad. They are willing to have a try. Meanwhile, the outstanding features of SII has been defined clearly. Once upon a time, Eastern and Western education modes were combined, which was impossible in the past. But now, based on feedback from students and decades years of operation and cooperation by Dilfi and Surrey, we did it, and we did it well. We are the ones who have made innovation happen. By breaking down the language and cultural barriers, we will be greeted by a brighter and a more glorious future indeed. So, we are done. Thanks for watching. Mm -hmm.